Hello. Today we are looking at how to install Unity on a Chromebook. Firstly, we need to disable the Crostini GPU support, otherwise, you will have some display issues. So we will go to the following URL, which you will find in the video description. Under the Crostini GPU support section, disable the function. Now we need to reboot our system to enable the change. Now we will enable Linux apps on our device. To do this we will go to our system settings and click on the Linux icon on the left panel. Now we will turn on the Linux apps. Make the Linux folder as big as possible as Unity takes plenty of space. Now that we have enabled Linux apps on our system, we will continue to the next step, which is to run several commands in a terminal. The commands are in the video description. Now we will copy the first command and open a terminal session from our app menu. Next, we will paste the command into our terminal, either with a two-finger click on your terminal or click Ctrl, Shift and V together. This command will update our Linux apps repositories. This command should run automatically as soon as you paste it into a terminal session. Now we will install Flatpak and other packages which Unity requires with the second command. Press enter to confirm the installation. Now we will enable the official FlatHub repository on our Chromebook. With the last command, we will install Unity. Press Enter to confirm the installation. Press Enter again. This is a long process so we are going to fast forward it. Unity Hub is now installed on your Chromebook. Let's launch it. Now that Unity Hub is running we need to activate it.
Now we need to log into Unity. For privacy reasons, we will not show you this part of the process. Now we need to install the Unity editor. We recommend that you use 2019.4 as it is the only one that currently works on a Chromebook, at least for us. Choose any of the options here that you need. This is an extremely long process so be patient. Our screen recorder crashes during this process so we paused it and just took screenshots of the process, which we will display now. Now that the editor is installed, we will create a project. Enjoy Unity.